Also ahead, billions of your tax dollars spent with no proof of where it's all going. But not for long. Next to 10, our investigation gets results. HMOs get some heat today at the state capitol. Lawmakers are pressing them to open their books and explain how they spend billions of your tax dollars. Today's hearing comes after we told you that they were not audited. By the way, this news reporter Jay Coles was there. and He's live tonight at state capitol. Jay. Leah, it was very interesting. The HMOs are definitely feeling pressure publicly to open their books. And for the first time, we heard tonight that they might be open to the idea of a legislative audit to explain how they spend billions of your tax dollars. They packed the halls of the Capitol. Taxpayers and health care advocates filled a legislative hearing to capacity looking for answers. Nurses, patients, and taxpayers want to know how much of that $3 billion is actually being spent on direct patient care. In December, we first reported this was coming when we uncovered HMOs that make millions from state programs are not audited. These are our tax dollars, and we want to use them to cover people. Uh, to take care of people in need, and we want to think about new and better ways. Healthcare advocates told lawmakers that HMOs make their profits off taxpayer finance programs with no state audits to make sure the money is spent correctly. And they're making all their money off of us. Shouldn't we insist that our programs be run? a little better, a little more sharply. And as she faced questions from lawmakers, a representative for the HMOs said something unexpected. If the state feels that more analysis is needed to explore an independent analysis of the outcomes, enrollee satisfaction, and costs for providing care through managed care to enrollees in the state, let's do it. And now that's important because that's the closest the HMOs have come to agreeing to a full-blown state audit. Now, we're told House Democrats are crafting a bill that could force their hand, and we might see that as early as next week. Reporting live in St. Paul, Jay Coles, 5 Eyewitness News. And you can watch more of our extensive investigations into the HMOs and read their plan to change health care here in Minnesota on our website, KSTP.com. Okay.